Hey boys, it's harm none. Today I'm in Grand Theft Auto Online with my friends NPC and Twinge for yet another Top Gear style challenge. In today's challenge, we're going to be doing the classic cars challenge, meaning all of us are going to have to pick a sports classic vehicle, but particularly a older sports classic vehicle, not something a little bit more modern like the Grotti Turismo classic, for example. We're then going to go customize the cars, upgrade them, and then bring them back to the airport to start competing in a series of challenges. Three points will be assigned for winning an event, two points will be assigned for coming in second, and one point will be assigned for coming in last place in the events. Then we're going to total up all the points at the end and find out which of the three classic cars is the best. So let's go ahead and buy some cars. All right, let's buy our cars. All right, let's buy all our right. cars. All right. Uh, yeah, we're going to go here. Okay, yeah, I bought my car. All right. Last cars. That was quick. I know, yeah. I'm just, I'm really fast. I'm Man. just really fast. Yeah. I was even faster than normal. Yeah, I know. The Classic Broadway. Oh, that's Who's going to pull up? <laughs> <laughs> I dare somebody to pull up in the Classic Broadway. You'll to get win. smoked. Yeah. This is, mm, that's, a, that's a good one right there. I think I'm going to go with this one. Oh, this he's solid. Go, you're going to go with this one? Yeah. Okay. I, I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with this one. I will see you guys later. Oh, oh damn! He's, oh damn! He okay. he's gone, gone. Okay, all right, all right, guys. So I know that I didn't actually buy a car on the website, and that's because I was coming to Simeon's dealership because we have some very special cars available this week. And what I am coming to get is, of course, the Ocelot Swinger, nine hundred thirty thousand dollars, six hundred and sixty. Uh, so. We're gonna go ahead and buy this thing. I'm buying it to the auto shop uh, because I think this fits the bill. It's uh, it's definitely an older sort of sports classic car. Uh, so anyways, I will see you guys at the auto shop. All right, and we're at the auto shop and the Swinger has arrived. That was pretty quick. I wonder if Simeon's delivers faster than normal. I don't know, it's crazy. Um, anyways, let's hop into this. Starting off, uh, we have $200,000 to upgrade this vehicle, so we're gonna have to we're gonna have to be tactical with our upgrades. So um, I'm gonna put two hundred thousand dollars onto my calculator real quick, and we're gonna start off with the engine upgrade. Um, I'm only gonna be going for a tune today. Nothing, nothing else. Thirty-one thousand eight hundred and twenty-five dollars. So that's already gone. So we've already only got one hundred and sixty-eight k left. <laughs> so that's that's rough um okay another thirty-eight thousand dollars minus off of the total and for the turbo another forty-seven thousand five hundred dollars so let's get uh, let's get that done um suspension do we want to lower it down i'm thinking probably but at the same time i don't really know it's probably going to be worth it let's go 32 30 let's just let's just put it on we might as well i think um for brakes that's gonna cost us 33 grand. Ah, I don't know. I don't know about the brakes. I don't think they're honestly gonna help that much. I don't know if it's worth it. I don't know, is there anything else we can do? Let's see, is there a spoiler option of some, of some sort? On the hood at all? No, nothing. Okay. Okay, do I wanna go for cosmetic stuff? Because I don't know. I, I... I don't know. Okay, well, let's let's start off with the color of the vehicle. Um, I think that ooh, it looks really good in black, but I think that uh, they're going for some sort of a metal, like brushed steel or brushed aluminum. I think that looks really good. Um, the color of the car does not count, like the paint uh, or the respray. Um, it doesn't count for cost. So let's go ahead and put that on. And then for the secondary color, what if we go for? A metal but what if we go for a brushed black steel that looks kind of sick as a secondary color kind of like it let's go ahead and uh go ahead and throw that on trim color on the interior that only does the steering wheel i'm not even going to bother changing it um the livery we already got one on the vehicle so i kind of don't want to take it off because it's going to cost us 10 grand just to remove it so i don't really think it's worth it um, i think we might as well just keep it on the vehicle and roll with it for the grill, I kind of want to change the grill, but unfortunately there's nothing we can really do to make it look like that much better. Uh, for the exhaust, uh, maybe we'll go for the slanted dual um, exhaust. That's going to be $1,710, so let's go ahead and uh, purchase that for the vehicle. Um, for the plate, we're going to go for the SA exempt today. I kind of like the look of that, so we'll go for that. 
um, for the trunk. Is this a spoiler option? It's not. Hmm. Or at least it doesn't count as one. I don't know. Do I add that on? I feel like it's kind of ugly looking. I guess I could go for just the uh, stock trunk with the latches. That's a pretty low key option. Maybe we'll do that. 665 for that. Let's let's go ahead and roll with that. For the lights, we could put a neon kit on. That would help a lot. I think I'm actually going to do that. It's $28,500. So let's Let's go ahead and throw that on. I'm going to leave it in white. I don't really care. As far as armor goes, it's probably not really worth getting, but maybe some brakes would be worth getting. 33 grand. Let's do it. Let's do it. $33,250. I don't know what else we're going to spend it on. We have 15 k left. Ooh, I don't know. Wheels, maybe? Maybe some wheels? I don't... I don't know I don't know what looks good on like old cars like this. I really don't. Like I suck at actually picking. I feel like I feel like the wired aren't bad. Let's go for the wired. That's gonna that's gonna cost us four thousand and eighty-five dollars. So it's really not that bad. We have eleven grand left to spend. Uh, for the wheel color, let's do them in a black. Uh, so another 561 minus. So let's go ahead and do that. And the windows, let's maybe put like a uh, I'm not gonna do a limo tint, but let's put like a let's put a dark smoke on there for uh, 3325. Um, so we have 7,349 dollars left to spend. Maybe we do the chrome horizontal grill for uh, 2850. We might as well do that, I guess. Why not? <laughs> um, okay, we have 4,499 dollars left. What do we want to do? We could do one hood option. Maybe we should do this just to match up with the back of the car. Let, let's go ahead and do it at uh, 2850 again. So let's spend that. We've got $1,649 left. I think we pretty much maxed that out. Um, it looks pretty good though. I'm happy with it. Let's uh, let's exit. Let's uh, head over to the airport and then uh, we'll get ready for the, uh, the first event. All right. And is anyone going to be here? Oh, NPC is here in... Is that a Casco? It is a Casco. Oh, a Cabernet Red or a Wine Red Casco, perhaps? Is that what that is? Kind of looks like it. So that's why you bought your car so fast, you uh, cheeky guy. I, I don't know what you're talking about. That's smart. How did oh. He done? oh, 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 where is he? Coming up. You excited? I'm, oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited I've, to I've never, be here. I've never been more excited in my whole life. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's People everywhere. He's in a Cockhead Classic? Cockhead Classic. Oh my the god. Invitero Cockhead Classic. Oh my goodness. I like oh, that. Oh yeah. What? It looks so cool. What color? The invisible Cockhead um, Classic in its camo. It's it's a I think it's an olive green with a bronze pearlescent. I love olive green and I love a bronze pearlescent on an oh, olive it looks green. Oh, so good. Looks so I think good. this car really fits the olive green too. You're gonna get hated on for sure, but uh, well, they can. Yeah, no, that's what I. Said Whoa. Too. Except yep. I don't. All right. Okay. All right. Well, dudes. boys, you're in the convertible, buddy. You get to throw the grenade. Look at that. I sure Let's am. We ready? I'm, I'm ready. excited to see I'm how this ready. goes. Right, I'm throwing excited. it. I'm Let's go. I'm excited. Let's see. Good launch. Oh my Some god, the spin. swinger off the launch. Oh my god. Yeah. Good launch. Oh no. See you later. Oh man. Come on, cats, go pull, pull, pull. Oh no. Is the swinger pulling? I don't know. No, oh, no, you're I think pulling. I'm catching up. You're pulling. You're pulling. Oh, what? Not fast I enough. I am too a little bit. No way. Damn, oh, that's tough. Goodness. And I'm over the fence. That's <laughs> tough. <laughs> Oh, that's brutal. What? Oh, man. Did wow. not expect that. I, I did not man. expect that either. I really did not expect that. But the casco would be a little faster. Wow. It's, it's not a bad car, no, but it's, man. It's not a bad car, but yeah, this thing's... Uh, this the thing's, swinger's fast. This thing's a little quick. For our next challenge, we're going to be racing around the Alamo Sea, starting over here by Trevor's house at this intersection. And we're going to take this main road all the way around through Grapeseed and then looping all the way back around. And the first person to pass this welcome to Sandy Shore sign is the winner. So, boys, it's time to race. You're on it. Here we go. Uh oh. Look out, this guy. Oh, oh. close one. Oh my close. god. I'm surprised he survived, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, there goes the jugular again. 
The jugular. Is that what it is, or the jugular? Oh, you got the well, how am I? How you am the, I keeping up so much? You got the same. You got the brand right. It's the swinger, buddy. Oh, damn. Uh, oh man, you guys are gonna like pass me. What's up? Yeah, what's going on right what? now? Am I pulling? You are pulling. What? Bruh. What? Oh my gosh. What? Well, you know how oh, FPS matters? I, I'm not going to lie to you. I just closed 20 Chrome tabs, so. I might have just installed this a cheat stupid. code. <laughs> oh, Rip Biker. Oh, oh my yeah, that's, God. That's where the swinger, that's where the swinger does, its, uh, does, its, does its magic right there in the corners. Oh yeah. No spoiler option, no problem, buddy. Holy. Oh man. Oh my, what are you doing? Oh, oh, oh these bushes, these bushes. Oh man, whoa, what the hell? That Canis Mesa was so far over to my side of the road. Oh my God, bro. Oh my God. I will say these that <gasps> too early. I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. Oh my god, I not again. Soon. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh man. Oh man, you gotta use the brakes in these cars. Yeah, you gotta play. <gasps> you gotta, that was close. Gotta play it smart with these old things. Even with max brakes, it's still not very good. Yeah. The swinger is performing well. I have to say off-road. I'm quite impressed. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. Oh my Jesus. I spoke way too soon. Oh my dude, go. No 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 no. Do not do this to me right now. Do not do this to me right now. Come on. Catch him, bro. Just as I started praising the car. Oh no! my god! Oh, I think you might be safe. I'm I'm backwards again. <gasps> I am too. Oh my god. Oh my god. Go. Just just drive. Just drive. Just drive. Just drive. Just drive. Get back to the pavement. Just get back to the pavement. Is all. That's all I ask. That's all I ask. Oh my god. Uh... Oh my god. Please, please, please. Come on, take him out! Someone take him out! I pray that Casco doesn't uh, use its top speed against me again. Oh my god. <sighs> no! Always that pole, bro. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Alright. Harmnad's done it. Again. Basically no mistakes on the circuit race, except for a few. <laughs> But I have definitely come first. This is this has got to be a record for me. <sighs> Across the line, baby. Why is there a belt? And just like that. Oh. Across the line. Just, just like barely. That. What is this red thing? Oh, there's a robber? Somebody just robbed the bank over here. I'm for uh, the best looking car. Best looking mm -hmm. car challenge. Let's go. Um, um, I think we got a winner this time. Yeah. I, it's me. I I really like the Stingray. It's the so Stingrays cool. are really good looking car. Yeah. It's it's really simplistic, but like it works. I don't know, man. The I edges love the rear are end like, on this. Yeah, the rear end looks so cool, bro. It's just got such a good shape, and it's nice that the the back gets elevated. Mm hmm. I mm -hmm. like the arches that come up on the wheels. I like that. And yeah. I, I did. I bought the hardtop version when I bought this at the beginning, but. I did end up changing it. It just looks so much better with the flat back. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and I kept the stock that. wheels on it too. They're a little bit thicker. They come like straight I like it, down dude. and yeah. right to make like a 90 degree angle. They look better than the other ones. Yeah. Are, are, are they bigger in the back than the front? They look like yes, it. Yes, they are. They're, yeah. They're staggered for sure. Yeah. Yeah, no, very cool. I, I, I'm happy to give the Cockett Classic the, uh, the number one on this. I, I think it looks very good. Did oh, I call it yeah. the Stinger? Thing right? It's the Cockett Classic. Yeah. Invitero Cockett Classic, please. A Stingray in real life. Yes, it is a Corvette. Is it the Stingray it's or a, is it just a Corvette? It's a Corvette. I don't. Uh, it could be. A I stingray. never understand the Stingray I don't terminology. Get, yeah, I don't get it. 
But I think it is one of the ones that uh, I think it yeah. Some like the what Mark Wilde drove in the World Race, which is yes. super cool. It's so not great, cool. but that one looks so good. That that one's super cool. It's like wider and flatter, a little sportier so looking. Got like the racer cockpit too. I think this one's just a two seater. Still cool. Yeah, this is nice. I like it. it looks so menacing in the front. It does. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very good looking. And uh, for for second, this is a it's the casco. I'd have to agree with the casco. Yeah, I, I hate the ocelot swinger. I think it's, really, I, I, I hate it. I I think it's it's unique looking. I I will say the casco is a really nice looking classic it's, it's car. It's just like cla It's it's got a classic this is like, shape to it. Yeah, it's got. This is like the image of classic car that like pops into your mind. You yeah. know, it's like a Bond car. Yeah. Yeah. Like exactly. Italian. Exactly, yeah. um, I I think the Ocelot Swinger looks cool. Like I feel like it doesn't deserve hate. Um, uh, I think it looks like a fish. I, yeah, a, a I little bit. It does fish. look. It's got a bit of penetrator syndrome. It's got penetrator catfish, syndrome. Catfish, yeah. Sure. Catfish moment, but uh, it looks like futurist. It looks like a flying car. I think it it's a cool shape. In the back. But... Yeah, I don't. I don't like it. I know that. I've, I've never been a fan a of this of style of car. Yeah, though. no, I haven't either. Either. I, I don't like from the 50s or 40s yeah 50s i think or like racers and stuff like yeah i, yeah, I don't i yeah i'm not a big fan of it so I'll, I'll gladly take the l here it's uh yeah no okay valid yeah well fast uh, fastest uh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> speed yeah. Now, bro. <laughs> yeah that was a speed <laughs> round for sure um well it's time for the uh Ooh. it's time for the sprint race oh next up we got the sprint race and for this challenge we're gonna be heading down here to the cove i think that's what it'd be called uh the rules are no highways and no off-road so you can't cut across the mountains or the fields or anything it'll have to be regular roads or dirt roads that are like paved kind of you know i have to go yeah. down into the city for this one down in the city we're taking the long route this time yes all right here we go are we ready here we ready. go all right three two one throwing rev up your engines gents Rev up the Bugatti. Go, Rev go, go! The Bugatti. Oh. Oh, nice bit of contact. Big drag race. Big drag race. Man, it's still pulling on me. It's a fast car. It is. Oh, oh. Oh my oh. god. Oh my god. Oh, these brakes, oh, man. Oh, yeah. Go, 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 go. Come on, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Whew. Oh my God, come on now, come on now. Martin. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Whoa there, buddy. Oh no! Yeah, it's your fault oh. too. <laughs> Let's go, let's Top go. Cheater, we <laughs> need to team up on him. Yeah. I didn't do anything, bro. He's always cheating. Oh, Look at this guy. oh my god. The cope. The cope is insane. There's nothing else that can explain this. Right. Yes. Oh my god! No! What is the f***ing penumbra doing? It's so laggy, bro. I didn't know which way to go. Dude, this GTA server, like, sucks ass right now. It's because of so many none. lag in our and yeah, yeah, he's literally lag switching us. Right, right, yes. No, oh no, oh no. Oh yes, oh yes. Oh my god. Oh shoot. Um. <laughs> what did oh, you do, no. NPC? Which way? Oh yeah. Oh no, I had a root in my head and it's gone. God, it oh no. God, it feels good to know the map. Oh yeah, Look at baby. this guy, cheating. Oh my god, these are lots of co close calls. Here? Oh. Oh, bruh. 
Oh man, I'm really hoping I don't see NPC sitting at the end here, waiting for me. There's no way you're ahead of me though. I'm so, I'm, I'm lost. Bruh. Hope you're not off-road. No. Oh! No shot, bruh. No shot. That just leads to the same place. Ooh. Oh my god. Yay. Nice. I got so lost. Oh, oh my god. Feels feels good. Feels that was good. a fun route. That was a fun route. I I like I liked the complication of it. It was very fun. Mm -hmm. um, there was a pretty solid route that we both followed. Yeah, yeah, there was a pretty solid one. What are the best value? What are the yeah. what are the costs of these cars? Because I'm I, gonna have to check again. I don't actually know. I think the Asco is six hundred eighty grand. Okay, and the Swinger is nine hundred and thirty, I believe. About. Oh, Ooh, I'm at six six five. <sighs> so you guys are both right around the same same cost, actually. Uh huh. My car's. What, just under 300 grand cheaper? Like 260k? Cheaper? Yours is 900. Yeah, I mean, I mean okay. more expensive. More expensive. 200, yeah. 200, and like, yeah. Some odd. Yeah. Yeah. Swinger's yeah. fast, man. It that is. price goes into its performance. It definitely does. It's, uh. It doesn't seem 300k faster than our cars. I so. agree. Not it 300k also looks faster. A lot uglier it, than it our cars. It is a lot uglier. I would say the Casco has got a pretty good chance here. I mean, well, I agree. actually, I think it's no, a solid actually, second, but I don't know. I think the the cockhead takes place because uh, also having a four thousand dollar computer really helps with speed, and because of that, I think I could have been a lot closer to you in the drag, and I was like maybe a hundred or two hundred feet behind you. I'm not sure if that's a correct estimate, like. For the sprint race coming towards the end so i think it held its own pretty well it did hold considering its, it's not well. that good handling either and the brakes are pretty bad but i can't remember are yours brakes as well pretty bad uh my brakes are not the best yeah uh, maybe it's a sports classic thing yeah i think it's a sports classic thing however i will just say swinger did win every single performance event well you do have the best computer and the fastest car and got lucky because I always get smacked by NPCs coming in the Omicron hey, lane. I, it happens to me too, if you remember. No, it yes, doesn't. It does. no, yes, it doesn't. Yes, it does. I'm the only one who's ever had a vehicle destroyed on the, on the circuit race. <laughs> That's because it was your fault. You drove it into the water. I saw the video. You can, no. No, no. I'm yep. dead. Yep. I'm dead. You know what? I Okay, so I, the swinger's good, but... We're talking about value, like as a whole, right? And mm -hmm. I think if you value looks, which we all do, that definitely takes away from the swinger. Interior looks pretty cool, actually. It Is does that look pretty cool. No, no, oh. you it's got can, a whole you, bunch of dials and stuff. You can change the uh, steering wheel color. Whoa. Yeah. Okay, that might make it worth it then. You think so? <laughs> yeah, because you can't change it on the cockette. Really? And I think that that's a winning thing yeah oh the interior the, you know, is sick actually what the casco has no customization yeah the swinger has quite a bit of customization actually the livery that's on it came with the car uh, because i had to buy it from simians obviously um kind of gross in my opinion yeah it's not it's not very good but it has tons of livery options and it's also got customization like you can change the headlights the grill uh, you can also put some stuff on the back of it. There's hood options. It's got some customization, so you can make it look less ugly at the very least. Okay. Um, and the interior is very nice, like you say. Yeah, the it, cockette's got some liveries, but still not too much customization around it. I kept most of the chrome accents as stock, and I think it looks pretty nice like this. It does. Honestly. It does look very nice. I, I Black do, stripes are good too. I do. Yeah. I do really like it. Uh, yeah, I think the stinger, the stingray. The Cockette Classic. I'm just going to say Cockette Classic. It the Invitero really... Cockette Classic. Yes. It, I, I like the chrome accenting on uh, 
on all the sports classics vehicles yeah. actually they look really nice it does and the stripes do look really good they do oh yeah they do look really nice but i'm gonna just say it bro casco i feel like like well it's not bad i just think the others have have more going for them because like the casco oh wait the casco is really good sounding it does sound Ooh. good I, oh. I'd like to give it a little startup real quick, just to hear it. Oh, <laughs> oh, that does sound good. This is this is like Holy. top ten sounding vehicles in the game. Okay, yes. the startup was mmm, chef's kiss. Wow. Hang on, I think I think this. Uh, I want to hear hear too. these. It takes so long to rev up. It does. It revs very slowly. Did uh, you do the, the pocket classic? Pretty uh, generic muscle standard. car. Gen yeah. No special startup either. Generic muscle car V8 sound effect dot yeah. MP4, <laughs> MP3. Yeah, so um, yeah, what is this one called again? Casco. The Casco. Casco. Uh, the Casco definitely takes the it cake for sound. It definitely sounds the best. Oh my god! Yeah. It's it's just so hard because it's, it's like a toss up. It's, it's really a toss up because all three of the cars are really good in their own right. Like yeah. if you want performance, get the Swinger for sure because it is a top ten fastest sports classic, uh, performance wise around track and it's pretty quick. The handling's nice and everything. If you want like good sound, then definitely get the Casco. Um, it sound classiness yeah and classiness like, yeah. yeah like it's it's a, it's a very nice car and then if you want like a classy american vehicle that looks phenomenal it's got a little bit of customization as well you can have it in a drop top or not as well um or, or with a roof or without i, I should say um, then the cockpit classic is is your vehicle who's who wins this one well that's the thing i don't know that's i'd like thing. to win this one so I, I think I, it's. I think it is this baby. But I feel like I don't know. There's not it's, one that's like not, so much better yeah, than another the, one well, that I can give it more points. They, like I would feel bad giving one three points and one one point. Yeah. Like I. I, mm. I mean, I hate how the swinger looks, but the performance is so much better than the other two. It just is. It's just. Well, I was. I was kind of catching you on the on the straights. When we this were doing the start true. of the sprint race along the long kind of paved way, we were all pretty close together. We were together. all pretty close. I didn't get the greatest start, but we were holding it NPC. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, no. We also got the better. Computer, I did have the so better. I don't know. It's if it's, it's not if it's that. that much the, the swinger is literally a top ten fastest sports classic, whereas these two are not even. I don't. I don't even know where they place to be honest. So performance wise, the swinger definitely wins yeah in general i that's what that's all i'm saying sure. yeah okay i can get behind okay that. but it's not like the others are bad no they're, they're not terrible and they are cheaper it really and just if depends you're on the budget yeah and if you want a car with a spoiler no yeah i mean yeah exactly but in this price None range of these cars like do. sub one million dollars I don't know. I don't know what you would pick. Honestly, I'm happy to leave the points at whatever at what they're at right now because I because you're gonna win. <laughs> no matter what, I'm gonna win. I, okay, I'll take last. I'm at 11 okay. points. Can I take first? Yeah, you take first. You're at 11 too. It's just tied. Okay, first. now we're tied. Yeah. <laughs> Happier with that. Okay, there you go. And, and NPCs NPC gets second. Good for him. At nine. So NPCs got nine points. Twinch has 11, and I also have 11. So. There you go. I think that's kind of like fair points across. Yeah, honestly. It's, it's pretty. It's pretty even. Yeah, cool. I, I actually before we wrap up the video, I want to do one more drag race, but we like rotate cars by one or something. Oh, good idea. Good idea. I think that would be fun. Just just to see. Man, this thing this thing does feel really good actually. Like just moving around in it. Yeah, it's very agile. All right. All right. Grenade right. is thrown. All right. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh man. Oh man, you guys are like toe wow. to toe. Oh. oh. Come on. Oh, now. both pulling. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> All right. 
Interesting. All right, round two. Round, round two. Ready. Here we go. Throw in. Oh, baby. Man. I'm telling you, it's it's different. Yeah, maybe it, it is just fast. It's different when you're on the drag strip versus when you're like actually on the road. The Casco is dead last again. Damn. Ah. Oh, oh Harmon's cheating with his four thousand dollar <laughs> computer. Uh. <laughs> yeah, let's try it again. Let's let's try it again. And we'll 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 settle this. We'll settle Back this once and for one. all. All right, grenade is thrown. Rev up your engines. I'm not cheating. <laughs> uh huh. Mm hmm. I'm a lot closer now. Yeah, yeah what? A lot closer now. I, I'm what? gonna pass you. Wait. Oh my god. I'm so close now. What? what? I don't understand. How yeah. was I so fast on the on the start of of both the circuit race and the sprint race? I'm telling you, it's because you're in a different. It's because you're in a different area. It's something to do with not being at the at the drag strip. I don't know the what location it is. of the map. What? I, I guess. Which longitude you're at? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. You, yeah, you definitely were faster. So now that, that so strange. Now that the swingers won, are we willing to say it's the best value? Uh, yeah, now that we can the say that testing is unreliable, I say the cockpit <laughs> is a winner over everything. <laughs> <laughs> the cockpit's fast, man. It but is it's, fast. It's handling is. I, I don't know. It's a bit it definitely more spin out. I think it's more fun to drive though. It's, it's not like bad where you'll spin out all the time. No. I think it's a good kind of. Swing. It is a fun car to drive. I I would I would give the Cockett second best value for the money because it is ever so slightly cheaper than the Casco as well. That's the other. And it's right. faster. And it's faster. It's Supposedly on yeah. the drag strip yeah. anyway. On the drag strip. Anyways. Sure, whatever. I I don't understand. I like the Casco still. I would personally take a Casco over the Cockett Classic, even though I like the Cockett Classic. I just the the sound. This is like the XA twenty one of of it is sports yes. cl sports classics cars. It's just reliable. It's good looking. It sounds good. That's yeah, that's what I need. But in terms of performance, I I guess third place every single time in the in yeah. the drag race. So uh, yeah, I, I don't really know what to make of it. So it's unfortunate. But uh, last place for the Casco. I think I think that puts me at thirteen points. I think that puts. Or wait, no, sorry. Yeah, I think it is thirteen because I was at ten. Yeah. Plus the three. Twinge, what were you at? Eight? You're at eight. ten. You're, so you're at ten now, and NPC is at uh, eight, I believe. Nice. GG's. We, we figured out a lot. We figured out which is the best uh, older sports classic vehicle in GTA Online with this, so uh, that, was, that, was, that was very good. Go subscribe to NPC and Twinge and myself if you guys are new. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. If not, dislike. Comment down below. Let us know some other ideas for some challenges you guys would like to see in the future, and that is pretty much it. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Peace.